As Tim said, my name is Jake Barton, graduated in 2008. My father graduated in 1979. My middle brother graduated this past May. My youngest brother is a freshman. So there's a lot of Trinity guys in my house. Um, I also graduated this past May from Virginia Military Institute, where I received my commission in the United States Marine Corps. And for the time being, I am waiting around to report back to Quantico, which is where I'll complete my training and get to the Fleet Marine Force. Until that time, I'm a substitute teacher at Trinity and assistant wrestling coach, and I love every moment, minute of it. I like giving back to Trinity because what Trinity gave me, it, it's an opportunity. That's about the best word to sum it up. It's an opportunity that not everybody gets, whether it be because of a commuter problem or financial problem, which is why we're here tonight. What you all do for young men at Trinity cannot be put into words. When I was at Trinity, I was in the honors program and I loved my academic classes. I loved the social life that I had at Trinity and I was on the wrestling team where I made a lot of friends, people that I call brothers. Now, going to Trinity for me was something I guess I knew was special, but I didn't know how special. And I'd like to thank my parents, Steve and Tamara, right here, because they really struggled to put me through. And I did receive a little bit of tuition assistance, and I did work study for all four years. Every little bit helped. But they really struggled to put me through, and 12 straight t years of tuition with my other brothers included. So uh, it's something that, that I really do joy, or enjoy, saying that I'm from Trinity, getting to look around and recognize all these faces of former classmates, of teachers, uh, Christian Robbins. I went to grade school and high school with his brother that he mentioned. Um, so each year, Trinity conducts a fundraiser known as the Trinity Annual Fund. And all the money that's raised for it goes directly to tuition assistance. And that type of tuition assistance is what allows so many young men to go to Trinity and enjoy the opportunities and to actually fulfill their po the possibilities. I know it meant a big difference to my family. I know it meant a big difference to one of my best friends who's not here tonight, but I'll tell you a story. His name's Taylor Mooney. He received a large sum of financial assistance when he's at Trinity, and if he didn't receive that, he would not have gone to Trinity. There's many people here that, that know him or know of him. He uh, went. Right after high school, he enlisted in the Marines. He did a tour in Afghanistan, Libya, and some other, uh, some other deployments. He now is at the Naval Academy, just completed his plebe summer. And I talked to him last night, actually, at about 3 in the morning, as we were both up. And uh, he's doing great. And I was telling him about this, and I told him I was, I was a little bit nervous. And he said, no, nah, you got it. So, People like Taylor are the ones that really benefit from this. I know I was fortunate enough to have parents that were able to, to help push me through and make ends meet, but there are kids that that's just not a possibility, and they need this, this assistance financially. So I'd ask you all to please give to the Trinity Annual Fund, because by doing so, you're making an investment, not only in the school itself, but actually in young men's lives. If you've already given, well, I'd say thank you. If you haven't, I would encourage you to do so. No matter how big or how small it is, know that it actually impacts someone. A young man's life is impacted by that. So when you see information about the Trinity Annual Fund, I hope you'll support the effort and really do, really do know that you are making a difference, not only in the school and the environment, but also in a person's life. Thank you very much.